Hello friends, what's up? Welcome in the world of Maths by Amiya. There are two questions in front of you, question number one and question number two. When you check the pattern, the pattern is plus minus plus minus plus minus. That is the pattern is the sign of alternate of plus minus. In this, this is the minus 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 minus. So we can say in question number one, we are following alternate sign. In this, we are following the same sign. The alternate sign is starting from plus, then minus, then plus, then minus. So the first sign is plus. And in the same pattern, we are solving the minus, minus, minus. So our first sign is minus and rest are the same. How do we solve these type of question in the conventional method? Let's check. For question number one, we take the series sum is equal to x. And this is 5 plus 2 root 5. We are again getting 5 plus 2 root 5. So we replace this complete series by x. So our equation becomes 5 plus 2 root 5 minus 2x because we replace this complete series by x because infinite minus something is infinite. So this complete series is if x and we replace this root with x, our new equation becomes under root 5 plus 2 root 5 minus 2x equal to x squaring both the sides. Then again squaring both the sides, we will get a 4 degree equation. And after solving the 4 degree equation, our x becomes 1 plus root 2. This is really a tough process and a cumbersome. Assuming a series is x, again replace x with the sum values and making an equation either quadratic or 4 degree or 6 degree equation. There is no need to do this calculation if you have this type of question. This is my first learning concept video in which I am saying please mug up a formula because doing all these things is really a tough task. So the formula for this type of question is if you have a, b, a, b, a, b infinite roots and all signs are same, then formula is under root 4a plus b a square plus b by 2. And if you have alternate sign, then formula is 4a minus 3b a square plus b by 2. If question will come in your examination, apply the formula and solve the question. Though the conventional method is the best, but if you know this formula, you can do wonders in the examination. I'm again repeating if all signs are the same. That means all are the plus, then formula is 4a plus b a square plus b by 2. If alternate sign, then formula is 4a minus 3b a square plus b by 2. One thing you should remember, if all becomes minus b, then we are doing nothing but plus b replaced by the minus b. If all are plus, then this should be plus b. If all are minus, then this should be minus b. So our formula is under root 4a plus b a square plus b by 2. If all are plus, under root 4a plus b square minus b by 2 if all are minus. I hope it is clear. In the same, if you have plus minus plus minus, first sign is plus, then minus, then plus, then minus, then this should be plus b. If this is minus plus minus plus means alternate sign starting with minus, then formula is 4a minus 3b square. If we place minus b in the b square, there is no effect of the sign. But if we place plus b as a minus b, this becomes minus. So my request to all, please note down this formula and use in your examination. I hope it is clear. Now solve questions. Question number one, that is 5, 2, 5, 2, 5, 2 and plus, minus, plus, minus, plus, minus. The formula for the plus, minus, plus, minus, plus, minus is nothing but 4a minus 3b square plus b by 2. So this becomes under root 4 into 5 is 20 minus 3b square, that is 4 square into 3 is 12 plus b is 2 by 2. So it is a plus minus plus minus. This should be plus. If it is minus plus minus plus, then this should be minus. This becomes 20 minus 12 is root 8 plus 2 by 2. Root 8 is 2 root 2 plus 2 by 2. So our final answer is root 2 plus 1. If you remember the formula, if you know the formula, you can solve this within seconds. I hope it is clear. Now also solve the second question. Our second question is 5, 2, 5, 2, 5, 2 with the same sign. If we have same sign, then formula is under root 4a plus b a square plus b by 2. If all signs are plus, yet all signs are minus. So we can replace this plus with a minus b. So our answer is under root 4 into a is 20 plus b a square is 4 and minus because all signs are minus minus 2 by 2. So this becomes root 24 minus 2 by 2 root 24 minus 2 that is nothing but 2 root 6 minus 2 by 2 is nothing but root 6 minus 1. I hope it is clear. Again I am saying please note down the formula or take the screenshot of formula and save in your folder. If you like the concept video and formula I would suggest please like the video, 
subscribe the channel for the upcoming videos and share the concept thank you and happy learning